After all these years of me having this very small YouTube channel, I have received various emails asking me, do I want to review certain products? Now, if I want to review them, I've got to pay for them. When I review them, they send me the money back. Complete no-no. So a guy called Derek from a company, now I think I'm going to say this correctly, Derek, called Tacos. He asked me, do I want to review the Amazon's choice of RGB mechanical wireless keyboard? And normally I dismiss them or normally I'll email back and see what they've got to say for themselves. But this one was legit and here it is. The RGB wireless keyboard from Tacos. Now this is my honest opinion on it and my honest review. And I'm gonna be honest with you, it's come at a time when I was actually looking for a keyboard. Now the computer you see behind me there, regular viewers off the channel will know that this is my XP build. This is what I found in the bin and I've lovingly restored it to back to what it was. I've retro brighted the front case and I've give it a nice black wood wrap as well. So you can see that there, that's all vinyl and stuff like that. That's for another video. Now I've changed the mouse is wireless and now I was looking for the keyboard, which is also wireless. And this came up and I'll tell you what, I am absolutely blown away by it. So in this video, um, it's gonna be just basically, as I say, my honest review. And I'm gonna show you the workings and how it works on possibly various systems because at the moment it's working on my XP machine. So uh, without further ado, just before we get into the video, uh, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about this keyboard. With its exceptional build quality and an impressive lifespan of up to 10 years, this keyboard is built to withstand even the most intense gaming sessions. It offers three connection modes, also features vibrant RGB lighting options to create an immersive and personalized gaming experience. What sets our keyboard apart is its competitive pricing, making it an excellent value for gamers seeking high quality performance and features. Currently, this keyboard ranks as the new top product in its category on Amazon UK. And in the box, we have one mechanical keyboard, one USB receiver, one user manual, one USB-C cable and one key puller. Compatible systems with this keyboard are Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, 8 and 10, Mac OS 11.3 or above and Linux. Right, okay, so as mentioned, we're running Windows XP. <coughs> keyboard is connected to the computer via the wireless dongle. The computer does not have Bluetooth, so I can't connect it via Bluetooth. So it's 2.4 gigahertz uh, dongle today, which works really well. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to show you the anti-ghosting. Now anti-ghosting, if you're not familiar with it, is when you can press various keys down and the computer will not sort of go up, go nuts. Back in the day, if you press a load of keys down together, you'd get various beeps and beeps and beeps from your computer saying, listen, all these inputs at once, we cannot handle all the inputs. But anti-ghosting, you can pretty much any key you want, press as many keys down as you want and it will not go off its head. Now I'm using notepad there. You might not be able to see it on camera, but um, I'll get a closer shot in a minute for you. Now the keyboard itself, I mean, how bloody good does that look next to me monitor there? The only sort of, um, probably not a downside, but um, I was thinking about the arrow keys for gaming, but they're here on the corner. I completely forgot about them before. So what I might do is whack in a game, which is Quake 3 Arena, and I'll just show you what it plays, well, how it plays like a Quake 3 Arena. Right, get a bit of volume on this. Uh, menu off, uh, play. So the arrow keys there, as you can see, oh well you can see that on camera, but if I press the arrow key down, so yeah, all's good in the hood there, we can play Quake 3 Arena, uh, let's go here, this is a mouse and keyboard game, so um, where are we going here, let's go in here, and fight. 
and bring it on bring it on so these are the keys i'm going to be using primarily for the game as i say the white well the mouse is wireless and the game runs absolutely beautiful on this computer so scroll wheel on the mouse as you can see they're very responsive Is it spacebar? Yeah, spacebar jump. Oh. Oh. Hey. Who fragged me then? Minx. Leg it. Leg it. What the hell is that, this one? There you go now. So as you can see, the keyboard performs absolutely amazing with this. Tell you what, let's go to an easier level. Oh no, I Oh, that's the bloody game. Right, let's go. Uh, single player. Let's go to that one and fight. Uh, I can win. Something a little less hectic, should we say. Right, here we go. As you can see, zero lag from the keyboard. So on the back of the box, this keyboard is for Windows XP and also Vista as well. So like I said in the intro there, it's come at a time when I was looking for the keyboard anyway for this machine. So with this working on Vista. Now when you use a 2.4 gigahertz dongle anyway, you don't really need any sort of software. It's, it's just literally like plugging something in. I'm playing it. Oh, what a shot. So, yeah, absolutely very, very responsive. Oh, he got me, man. Even the space bar feels quite nice as well. Now, I'm just going to pause this for a minute. So normally your space bar is normally on a pin in the middle like that and it'll rock either side and sort of give you a bit of play here. But with this, it doesn't. It seems to be like nice and solid. Not as clicky as the rest, but yeah, really, really nice. Let me just turn that light out and see if I can get the RGB colors on the go. I don't know whether that's going to show up, but hell yeah. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to test one more game. And I'm going to give you my honest thoughts at the end of this video. Right, a quick game of Motocross Madness 2, and straight away, we're into the game. Escape key works. No lag whatsoever from this. Let's go for the air. Uh, oh, come on. Throw us back. Throw us back. Here we go. Get ready in three, two, one. Do you know what? I'm made up actually to have a system now which is practically wireless. As I say, here's the mouse. The mouse is from Trust, it's not, a, not special. Mouse mat, 
got from a good mate called Neil in um, in work, and uh, a nice little RGB mouse mat it is. Obviously, it's plugged into the back of the system, like to give the uh, the power. But right, we're gonna go for all keys down just to test the anti-ghosting. Here we go. Hands it like a bloody champ. See. Up and down. Very nice indeed. Very, very nice indeed. Well happy with that keyboard. Look at that. Just look how good. And you can even store it there as well but just look how good that looks next to me little monitor there that is absolutely fantastic oh so as mentioned in the video this review this opinion is my own tech halls have not told me to say anything other than the little sort of thing they gave me in the email about the keyboard and stuff like that now it's going to get used not only on the xp build but i'm going to probably use it on the laptop as well as my A500 Mini and C64 Mini, because as we know, them keyboards don't work on those things. But yeah, really, it's dead easy to set up. You've got two buttons there, FN or Function, switch between Windows and Mac as well, which I forgot to mention before, but yeah. A nice glow from it as well. Currently on film and at 60 FPS. Now, it's gonna show up in the video as a really fast sort of moving RGB, but believe me, it's nice and slow and nice calm. And when the lights are out, when my mouse mat is flickering away as it is now, this is going to sit next to it. The whole thing is just really nice and sort of calm. So I'm going to, I mean, for me to rate this as from 1 to 10, I'm going to give it a 9, mainly because if you rate things 10 out of 10, that means you can't get anything that's going to beat it. Now, anything you buy in life, I never really give it 10 out of 10. 9 out of 10. Mainly because I don't know much about these keyboards, the anti-ghost and the known stuff like that. Uh, but it, the, the, the build quality is really impressive. Feels really, really solid. And the 10 year lifespan, I could probably say, yeah, you know, it will. So all that's left me to say is thanks from, well, to Cause and thanks to Derek from To Cause uh, for getting in touch with me. I do think, I hope I'm saying that right, To Cause, To Cause, I don't know. But yeah, the company To Cause, Thank you very much for sending me this. As I say, it's come at a time when I was in the, well, looking out to get the keyboards for me uh, XP build. So yeah, cheers very much for that to cause. Very much appreciated. And um, cheers for watching as always. And I'll catch you in the next video. Nice shooting, son. What's your name? Siri.